In this video, I'll be showing you how to replace the battery on the iPhone 16e. First thing you want to do is take out two pent lobe screws. This is the first thing we need to do when opening any iPhone. Okay, then next to take out a back glass, we'll need heat and alcohol. We're just trying to soften the adhesive. So what's holding the back glass down is just strong adhesive. So we just need to blow some heat. This is a cheap heat gun I normally use. These go for around $10. Heat around, making sure we don't leave the heat gun on one spot. That way you don't get that spot overheated. So once we feel it's hot enough, apply some alcohol just to the edges. Just want to get some alcohol sipping in the edges that way it's going to also help soften the adhesive so like i said a mixture of alcohol and heat is really good when you're dealing with adhesive on iphones pretty much any phone okay i know most of you guys who are watching this this is probably going to be your first time there's always that feeling of fear when you're doing something for the first time but trust me it's not as hard as it looks for the first time it's going to look hard just put that fear aside and just get on it and i promise over time the more you practice this the better you get next thing we want to use is our suction cup just gonna put it on i like this suction cup because it kind of holds it really strong and we'll just gently lift so i'm just going to be lifting slow and steady okay, you can see mine open a little bit quicker than most probably not going to open that quick on yours take your time in this spot we don't want to just force it all the way and open it you want to keep going up and down gently that's going to help you open it easier once you see a little bit opening apply some more alcohol make sure it doesn't overflow just want to get enough just to touch the adhesive now we're going to insert our guitar pick i'm going up and down i'm not forcing it all the way you're going to end up breaking the glass that way apply some more alcohol you can also blow some heat. You're just going to keep repeating alcohol and heat all the way until you get it open. Make sure you're patient with this. Most of you guys who watch these videos, you're probably doing it for the first time. Take your time, be patient, and it's going to open. It needs a lot of patience. I know you guys see a lot of videos on YouTube where it's done really quick and easy. In reality, it's never that easy. So just take all the time you need. And I've got into the top here. I like to stop and I'll go all the way to the other side and repeat the same process of heat and alcohol. I keep talking about fear because fear is the one thing that keeps people away from trying new things. Make sure you just try. The worst thing that's going to happen is that you make a mistake, but you're going to learn from that mistake. We all have fears. Just try to get over those and you'll be fine. Now, the first timer is always Always going to be there for sure but the more you do it the better you get keep applying alcohol and heat and be patient i have a lot of experience doing this so i'm doing it a lot quicker than most okay now we're going to the top on this side i'm just going to take out the suction cup now the top i'll apply some more alcohol and heat then i'll wiggle the bottom this is how i like to do it just to easily take out the top okay now I'll grab the bottom and just wiggle it side to side gently and it should open to the right side but once the phone is open first thing we want to do is disconnect the battery that way we avoid any short circuit so we take out this plate right here that's holding down the battery's flex cable it has two screws once the plate is out we want to disconnect the battery as you can see it says positive and negative that's the right flex cable next we want to disconnect this flex cable that's holding the back glass it's connected to the wireless flex cable and the flashlight just has one screw take this plate out now we want to disconnect this flex cable your back glass is out we'll need a 9 volt battery and this alligator clip we'll be connecting it to this ground screw and this tab right here we want to screw this screwdriver a little bit then grab the black alligator clip and stick it to this screw grab the red one and stick it to the tab and we'll leave it for about 90 seconds after about 90 seconds we'll take the clips out and now we just pry it out it should come out easy see that see how easy apple made this this makes it easy for anyone who's doing phone repairs to just easily replace the battery next we grab our replacement battery we'll connect the battery flex cable and now we can align it properly press it down now we'll disconnect the battery connect the back glass flex cable put back its plate there are two hooks this is a tricky one so we'll hook the bottom one first and press it down a little bit tricky now screw down with the tri-point screw connect the battery put the plate on and screw it down same thing has a hook that needs to go in up from the top and screw down with the two tri-point screws close the back glass starting from the top and go to the bottom and middle don't forget your two pent lobe screws now you've seen how to replace the battery go try this out and let me know how it goes in the comments below if you'd like to see more videos like this check the video on the right and for a repair playlist check the playlist on the left thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next one